Hey guys, it's Andy, and in today's video, I'm going to be using the Double Dip Nails X Casey Nails Winter Angel Dip Powder Kit to create this set, or recreate it. And all of that started because of this color right here, called Almond Dust. I said that this reminded me of gingerbread, and now I wanted to create a gingerbread set. Like, look at that. It is kind of a dark color. It's quite a dark brown. Also, don't mind the boo-boos on my hands. My cats like to play with my hands. As you can see, it's kind of a dark, kind of burnt gingerbread, so we're gonna go with that. I'm going to be using these two colors. Like I said, the almond dust and vanilla cream for the white base nails. I don't want them to be completely white, and this is kind of a clear with glitter. I think it has a tiny bit of white in it, I'm not really sure, because it's kind of like a milky color. I used this in my last video. If you guys want to check that out, I will link it up here in the cards somewhere. So you guys can go watch that of me testing out her kit with double dips. So as you can tell, I already have my full cover tips on. These took me a while to um, file, that's why I just went ahead and did them, because I really wanted this video to be about the design and not me shaping full cover tips because I thought that would be kind of boring. So I already have the nails prepped, cleaned, and all that. So I'm going to take the Double Dip Premium Nail Liquid Set. So for this particular design, I'm going to be needing an activator and base coat. I will not be needing a dip top because I will be using gel. So I'm going to put almond dust on my thumb, pinky, and ring finger. Vanilla cream on my middle finger and pointer finger. Since these nails are pretty long, I'm going to have to create an apex. Probably don't have to because the full cover tips already kind of have that. But I just want to make sure. I'm going to just dip because I'm doing half of it first. I believe you do the side next. I'm not really sure. <laughs> I haven't done like an apex like this using dip powder before, so I don't really... No, I've just seen a few people do it on YouTube, but I want the color to be very, very opaque and fully on every part of the nail. Okay, surprisingly, the whole nail actually fits in the jar. That's pretty freaking cool. Yeah, I think that actually looks pretty good. Feels sturdy. The sides are just a little bit thick, but I can shape that pretty easily with the file. See, as you can see, a little bit thick on the sides, but I don't know. I still really like it. I love the color. Wow. Okay, so I'm gonna do the same thing to mm, these two, <laughs> and then do vanilla cream on these two. Okay, so the nails are all done and dipped. I actually was able to dip them because they fit to these really small jars, which was kind of surprising. We're just gonna take activator and make sure that all of the powder is off the nails. A little piece of fuzz, there we go. I'm gonna take the activator, which is number three. Put a ton of this on here. I do not want to be filing into glue. Now I'm just going to let these dry for about five minutes or until they sound dry. So now I'm going to shape and file these a little bit. They are a bit chunky on the sides, so I want to get rid of that for sure. Tick file. Let's reshape these nails.
Here they are, filed, shaped, and buffed. Wow, I really love how these came out. Now I'm just going to matte top coat all of these. Here are the finished nails you guys. I'm sorry that I didn't talk in like the nail art portion. I just feel like it gets really repetitive and boring. Um, so I just want you guys to like listen to some music while watching me do nail art. Um, but anyways, I really love how these came out, especially for my right hand or using my left hand on my right hand. They actually came out really good. I really love the pointer finger. Let me know which one is your favorite. Um, make sure you guys go follow Double Dip and Casey Nails on Instagram because like this dip powder is just amazing. I will say that. Um, and I will also link in down in the description below Casey Nails YouTube and her videos about the kit. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!